Burns to number 44, Let's Talk Burnley. And we have a new signing today, Friday the 18th of August. Tomorrow we play Blackpool at Burnley. Now I'm just wondering whether this new signing, Darko Jolinvov, will start or will he come on during the match? Now Burnley have signed this young 22-year-old winger on a on a four-year deal at uh, approximately five million euros. This signing is now the twelfth of Burnley's new signings. It could be available for the Blackpool match. Um, now uh, I've been, I've got a little clip of um, Darko Jalimov. Uh, playing for Stuttgart. It's only a short clip, so I'll have that as well as this particular um, video. Uh, right, so after the Blackpool game, we are playing on Tuesday uh, in the EFL Cup against Shrewsbury away. Now, hopefully, he can be is eligible for this particular game, it's a cup game. So maybe he won't be, but uh, hopefully he will be. Um, that's at 7.30 on Tuesday night. And then Burnley play Wigan Athletic away on the 27th of August. And then at home against Millwall on Tuesday the 30th of August. Now at the moment Burnley are lying 10th in the league. And Vincent Company has put it on record that he's hoping uh, to start climbing the Championship League table. And then when, when we have the break in November for a month, we come back and we are playing Queen's Park Rangers. And hopefully by then uh, he'll have a team out that will conquer all. This is Vincent Company's words. Uh, he believes that this team can now start climbing the championship and will be a formidable uh, outfit against all that, that the championship can actually offer. Well, let's hope this is the case. I mean, some people are saying we're not going to go up this season, but I'm sure that we can get uh, in a position in the league uh, to be in the playoffs, if not automatic promotion this year, especially with the with the uh, players that is uh, coming in at the moment, and they seem very exciting. I know one one is exciting playing for other teams, but but uh, hopefully we can get them into the Burnley way of playing. I mean, even Darko, given his first interview, he said that he's watched uh, Burnley's games and he thinks that Burnley are a very exciting team to play. And he can bring in things that Burnley are lacking, uh, like a striker. He is a winger, but he also can be a striker as well. I don't know how many goals he's scored in his career. I, could, I tried to find out. I don't believe he is a prolific goal scorer, but obviously given the opportunity, he can score goals. So let's hope that this is the case and hopefully we're going to get maybe another striker midfielder in by the end of August. It's not long now to the end of August, um, but I'm sure that Burnley are now, um, they're all uh, getting on the same hymn sheet trying to get people in. I heard Vincent Company say in a recent interview that he wants to have uh, two players for each position on the on the team on the pitch and he thinks that he would rather have people that can play in any position rather than just one position so he can move people around and give them opportunities in different positions and he's also said that um, Scott Twine could be available very soon. So he's another one that uh, Burnley have in their folder to bring on. And Rodriguez uh, is available as well. He played against 
Hull and scored. Uh, but to me, personally, he should have scored at least two, if not three goals on that night. And also he could have passed, uh, instead of having one shot on goal, he could have passed that into the middle and uh, made other players available to score. But anyway, that's just me. Uh, let me know what you think uh, in your comments below. It's only a short video. This is just to give you the update. We have a new player, uh, Darko Cholinov. I think that's how you pronounce his name. 22-year-old winger. Uh, and he sounds that, that he's, he's going to be a very good player. So I'm looking forward to seeing him play and score. Um, well, that's it for now. Um, I'll be with you most likely tomorrow night uh, after we play the Blackpool game and maybe we'll be able to see him in action. Okay, that's it for now. All the very best. And let's go, lads. Up the Clarius. Keep it going. And we'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.